World famous skaters from the past and present performed last weekend at the Skating Club of Boston. Erin Crowley has the latest. The Skating Club of Boston has trained Olympic class figure skaters for the last 100 years. Last September, the club opened its brand new state of the art facility during the height of the pandemic. In early December, the $68 million club hosted a night of stars. The show, hosted by Olympic gold medalist Scott Hamilton, welcomed a lineup of renowned skaters to kick off the next 100 years of figure skating. Chair of the Norwood Board of Selectmen, Tom Maloney, shared congratulatory remarks for the local nonprofit. Well, I mean, we, first of all, it's a question of pride. We're very proud to be the home of the Skating Club of Boston. You know, one of the meccas of figure skating in the United States, it, it really in the whole world. So we're, we're proud of it for one thing. We're happy for, of course, for, all, for more practical reasons, we're happy all the people who come here who are going to not only come to the skating club, but stay in our hotels, go to our restaurants, and and uh, you know shop in our stores. So it's a great boon to the town. We're really happy about it, and uh, I can't wait for the night to start. At the new facility in Norwood, figure skaters train and perform inside the Tenley Albright Performance Center. Albright was the first U.S. woman to win the World Figure Skating Championships in 1953. Years later, she took home a gold medal at the Winter Olympic Games in 1956. Albright was recognized at the Skating Club's Night of Stars celebration and shared this message of support for the next generation of skaters training in Norwood. Looking back, if there had been some place like this amazing facility in Norwood, I'd wish I lived in Norwood. It is wonderful to see the connection with the community and to realize that one of the three ice surfaces here is really made for the Mustangs, the Norwood High School hockey team, and is, and is in the hockey team's colors. And there's a whole history wall about Norwood High School's hockey. The academic setup here that can be useful for students in, in Norwood itself is really something to be able to skate and train and do your homework in the same place and have fun with your friends here and have your lunch here if you want and bring all your computer online work right it's it's easy just to stay right here my piece of advice for a young skater would be put on the music have fun on the ice and don't worry about every single step be creative and yes, focus on doing your best, but as they say, work hard, but have fun doing it. Paul Wiley competed at the 1992 Olympics and took home a silver medal. He was amazed by the new club and its resources for young skaters. This facility feels like it's the nicest one in the entire world. You know, if, if you walk in, it makes you want to skate, it makes you want to dance, it makes you want to be an athlete, um, and it's inspiring with all of the pictures and the thoughtfulness that's gone into it, um, and I'm just proud to be a part of it. I mean, this was a really fun place to train. Uh, and I, I, loved, I loved Boston for the way that it combined a lot of essences, you know, together. And so I, uh, it's, it's really beautiful to see it. And I know that this facility will turn out some amazing skaters in the future. Scott Hamilton won a gold medal at the 1980 Olympics. Years later, he survived cancer and created the CARES Foundation to benefit others fighting the insidious disease. Scott has trained in clubs near and far and says that the Skating Club of Boston stands out in a league of its own. I'm blown away. The, this facility is without peer. I've never been in a finer facility dedicated to figure skating anywhere in the world. And it's, this, is a, this is a remarkable achievement. Um, not just for skating, but for the city of Boston, um, because th now you have the access. This opens up the access for more and more kids to get on the ice, more and more kids to see how good they can be, more and more kids to dream the dream, and, and there, there's nothing like this anywhere else in the world. I mean, it, this is as good as it gets, so it's just an honor to be here, to, to know that I've, I've spent enough time in here to have maybe a little history, you know, with the ice chips and all the old Boston Skating Club um, shows and activities and 
and have practiced on that ice, you know, many, many times. It's just, it's, it's really an honor to be here and to open this facility in the right way. The Skating Club of Boston is also home to the Norwood High School Hockey Program. We'll be providing coverage all winter long on Norwood Community Media. Kristen, back to you. Thanks, Erin. The Skating Club of Boston is located on University Avenue right here in Norwood.